I played around a half an hour or so on this guy here and uh, his name is George he's a pretty cool guy unfortunately my recording didn't record uh, and I've been talking for <laughs> half an hour uh, explaining stuff like what this bonfire is or what this message is and what this blood stain is I've been really good I've been really good to you guys explaining stuff um, and I, I've just come to the town and I've, I've done some stuff so uh, it kind of sucks uh, I won't be making another character just to do that stuff because I'm still level 1 I've got no points anywhere um, so what I'm just going to do is explain the whole concept behind this and uh, hopefully uh, hopefully it'll be some somewhat enough interactive thing between us oh there we go that's great I'm Lion King wish I could zoom out though I can't zoom out uh, I can however do like this Lion King and then a bit of sliding down here apparently uh, right so the, the concept of this video thing is that I will be playing as George and this will be the journey of George and I'm starting from scratch from level one I have no points allocated and I will leave that task up to you so right now just before I ended my previous recording I was telling you about the different stats and how they will affect my character uh, so I'm gonna do that again <laughs> at least and then next time we play I'll make sure that no, or I'll, I'll be better at recording apparently I guess my hotkey didn't work or something and uh, and you'll see how the game is played. I, I did come to this area and for those of you who know this game I have been going through the Forest of Fall and gotten to the tower with the uh, the weird lady. All of this will be explained but uh, for those of you who do know about this and yeah uh, and I have not died yet that's why I have this Beautiful complexion. Right. Let's try this one more time, explaining things. These are the stats that we can level up. All of them affect different things, and uh, hopefully, we'll find some sort of a, a nice balance of that. Now vigor, <coughs> uh, vigor increases your uh, your HP, how much life you have, uh, and pretty much only that. Endurance increases how much you can uh, sprint and how much you can uh, punch and roll and stuff like that. Vitality is how much you can carry. Uh, all weapons and equipment that you have on you will, uh, will weigh, <laughs> for lack of a better word, they will weigh stuff. Uh, and if it's too heavy for you, then you'll be encumbered or over encumbered, and and you'll be uh, you won't roll as well as you could. You'll be like just like falling down on the ground, and you can't sprint, and it, it, life is hard. Uh, what is this again? Attunement. That's for spell casting. So if you want me to be a spell caster, you can um, increase my attunement stuff. It'll help me uh, have more spells. I'm not too sure. I haven't played a mage, but I believe it will help me have more spells at the same time. 
and also how fast it cast them. Strength is for heavy weapons, uh, big weapons, so I can hold them, and also for uh, attack. Dexterity is for smaller weapons, uh, light swords and daggers, and uh, well, dexterity weapons, I suppose. Uh, adaptability is it also increases something called agility which I'm not sure but I think maybe that has more to do with dodging than uh, than stamina I mean you dra drain stamina when you dodge but it, this might help with the dodging I'm not sure someone should tell me this intelligence is for cast speed as well as uh, different uh, aggressive or offensive magics uh, we need that to cast good spells and faith is if we're um, holy guys and uh, we need to heal and stuff like that uh, now I said you have seven points seven points that you can give me and you can pretty much put them anywhere I will to my best <laughs> Try to put them exactly where you say you want them. Uh, you can just say something like, uh, like split them between vigor and endurance. If you're, if you're lazy, uh, you can say just max out vitality. Uh, but I mean, let's try to be slightly realistic here. Uh, and as as you will see, when we progress. Uh, some things require some things and hopefully you will do the right decision and sort of help me in the right way and not completely do me uh, and uh, yeah let's try to, to build a hero okay this journey of George we're going from zero to hero here right now we only have this dagger in our fist we also have a binocular but that doesn't do us any good can't even punch with you. I can only look through it. So, yeah. <laughs> I don't think we can punch through it either. Uh, I just give you a slight, a slight indication, like this cleric chime. I'm not even sure what it is, but it, it requires uh, ten faith. So that'd be four points if we went that one. Morning star, fifteen strength and seven dexterity. Uh, 7 strength and 10 dexterity, 7 strength and 13 dexterity. So, I mean, uh, there's a lot of. We need to get something up if we want to use something else in our dagger. And, you know, I'm not going for a level 1 playthrough here. So, hopefully, you can. You can give me a. a good journey. A great journey. Next time, after you decided how to doom me, or, or maybe, hopefully, how I will play this game properly, then we'll uh, then we'll see how many times I die. Thank you. Enjoy.